Okay, so, um, as you may or may not know, I love food a lot. Um, <laughs> if you, I don't know if you can hear this, if you heard a panting in the background, I don't have, like, some man chained up, like, waiting on me to, uh, do things to him. It's my dog. She's, she's all worked up. She wants to go outside. Come here. Yeah. She's, she's, we're about to go for a walk. Even, yeah. That's why she's got this. She's got this because she likes to fucking, uh, bark at other dogs because she thinks that they are threatening. Okay, go back over there. You don't want to be in this video anyway. No, go sit. Okay, back to what I was saying. I love food so much. Um, the thing is, sometimes I, like it, as I have mentioned in previous videos, I am not like the best at being a grown up and I don't always go grocery shopping when I should. Um, and when I do go grocery shopping, I don't get like a full, um, full supply of groceries. So for breakfast this morning, because I was running late and hit the snooze 17,000 times, um, I didn't have breakfast food. So what I did was I took with me to work <laughs> some Uncle Ben's teriyaki chicken rice and I ate it in my cubicle for breakfast. You know what? I don't know who decided that you need to have cereal, fucking uh, toast and bacon and eggs and cereal for breakfast, but that's bullshit. I will eat fucking toast and scrambled eggs and cereal whenever the fuck I feel like it, okay? You don't fucking tell me what to do. If I want to eat fried rice made via the microwave for breakfast, I will have rice. If I want to have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, if I want to have three peanut butter and jelly sandwiches for lunch, I will and I did. And if I want to have cereal for dinner, because I haven't officially had dinner yet, then I will have cinnamon fucking toast crunch for dinner and it's going to be awesome sauce in my belly. Okay? That's that. Please disregard um, this mess in the background. Clearly, I don't give a shit, so why should you, right? Um, I'll get around to it when I feel like it, because I'm an awesome grown-up. Um, okay, I went to Happy Hour tonight, and there were many happenings that occurred. First of all, the first bar that I went to, we sat next to, we sat in behind a window that looks out onto the street. And there was a man that walked by, shirtless, in, I guess, like, basketball shorts. So he walks by the window, and I'm like, what the fuck? Shirtless. It's like 6.30, 7 o'clock at night. And then he comes back around, he comes back the other way a little bit later. And at this point, his basketball shorts are slouching off to where they're just below his cheeks and his underwear showing. And I'm thinking... This dude's definitely going to be arrested later on tonight. So anyway, we walk to the next bar, and sure enough, I see this squad car. Lights are on. I'm like, it's the guy. It's got to be the guy. I'm sure they're talking to him. Absolutely. fucking -lutely. Walk a little bit further. Me, 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 me. There he is, talking to the cops. So we kind of walked by because I wanted to know what was going on, but I couldn't hear anything, so... I don't know what happened there, but um, I think he may have been drunk and or under the influence of some sort of mm, substance that may or may not have been prescribed to him or that a street pharmacist may have prescribed to him, right? Um, and then we were at the next bar and we were on the patio in a mariachi band came by and started doing their thing. That was cool. And then I was over and I decided I didn't want to leave through the door. So instead of walking through the restaurant to get to the front door or even leaving through the door that was out of the patio that I was just climbing over a bunch, a bunch, what, a bunch of grapes, I decided I would 
climb over a bench. Wait, I didn't climb over a bench. Well, I kind of did. I stepped onto the bench and I climbed over the bench and over the rail and that's how I left. And that was my night. And goodbye.